Living in luxury, some lucky students at Emerson College are dorming in the W Hotel during the pandemic. And the perks there include king size beds and weekly housekeeping. Pretty nice. Yeah, it sounds I don't good. remember that in college. <laughs> They're certainly not living the typical college lifestyle. WBC's Anna Ritas Rodriguez gives us an inside look. Towering over the corner of Stewart and Tremont is the W. Its luggage carts sit empty. The valet is quiet. But step inside the hotel and you'll see it buzzing with student life. What's up? I'm Nina. I'm a sophomore comedic arts major at Emerson, and this is my dorm in the W Hotel. Nina is one of nearly 200 Emerson College students living the sweet life at the W, dorming in luxury with floor to ceiling windows, king size beds, housekeeping, and private bathrooms. The accommodations are part of a plan to de densify campus this fall semester. Emerson is one of several Boston colleges and universities using hotels for housing and classes. I can take a bath. I can relax. I have a huge TV. I can watch cable. So it's actually, it's been pretty nice. So nice. This RA says she's had no complaints. They love it. Um, they're the only thing that um, people have noted, um, which will be the same across campus, is that this semester feels a little bit more isolated. And the rules are strict. No outside guests are allowed. Classmates from other dorms are also off limits. Students are tested once a week and must fill out daily questionnaires monitoring their symptoms. Compliance is tracked and connected to student IDs. You tap into buildings with those IDs. If you fail to complete um, your like um, symptom check survey, uh, your tap access will be shut off from other buildings. The privilege is not lost on them. We have to be very conscious of that and aware that this is somebody else's luxury property. They take great care of it, and so we should too. A far from typical but functional college experience fitting in the age of a pandemic. I'm Anaritis Rodriguez, WBZ News. Mm.